Hey, what's going on, everybody? I want to share this with you, something that I've been looking at for a while. And what we're looking at here is the movement of the magnetic north pole within the Earth. And we see between 1590 and 1994, within the last 400 years, it's, it's relatively stayed within northern Canada. But scientists are now saying there's two blobs in the Earth's core that are pushing and pulling against each other, causing the Earth's magnetic field to move north. Now, from 1994 to 2020, it's been pushing. And right now, we're averaging at approximately 4 miles a month. But it's past the prime meridian and is now starting to go south towards northern Russia. Now, there's a point on the Earth where if the North Pole reaches that point, our magnetic field will be the, the weakest it's ever been. And if it gets to that, solar radiation will begin to push into the Earth. But before that, because of the weakened magnetic poles, your GPS will fail. And once the GPS fails, we'll begin to see solar radiation coming in. We'll see new skin diseases that we haven't seen before, things that's gone undetected, cosmic radiation, all, all kinds of stuff. So it's moving four miles a month, and it has 144 miles to go until it reaches a critical point. At four miles a month, we're looking at 2023 when it reaches that critical point. Now, another thing that could happen when it reaches that critical point is a polar shift. Now, that means the core of the Earth will begin spinning in a different direction, and the poles will shift. Tropical will become Arctic. Arctic will become tropical. Volcanoes, hurricanes, earthquakes, all kinds of natural disasters, everything, the Earth will react to this very violently. And that's all depending on if it continues moving in the same direction it has been since 1904 for three more years. I thought I would share this with you guys. I can't really find any mainstream news that's sharing this, but it's probably because it's a very scary thing for most people. But it's a time that we need to be looking to Christ. Because this, this time that we're on earth, it's not promised. It's not going to last forever. You don't know when your last day is going to be. I love you guys, but Jesus loves you more. God bless.